24th, September 2023, I'm Dana Durford, back with another short video to articulate the incredible disaster that is uh, Fukushima's nuclear meltdowns. Reactor 3 was the mixed oxide fuel. Mixed oxide fuel. The building to the left, as you can see the depiction to the right, there was two fuel pools at the top of the building and the reactor cores at the top of the building. They're actually gone. The official story is they, they're not gone as of July the 13th this year. Full meltdown at three reactors. That included number three. Explosions occurred inside of the reactor one I showed you earlier. Generated uh, missiles that endangered the containment integrity. Well, the building is gone. Rapid meltdown at number two and three, indicated by the black smoke from number three. Number two and three had melted out of the reactors. It's black, murmured the prime minister after reactor number three exploded. Uh, journalists felt the explosion 25 miles away. Unit three severely contaminated after number three. Curium and plutonium, not tritium, outside of reactor three. The broken spent fuel rods were scattered. That's lethal doses everywhere. Up to two miles per hour, or away rather. Hydrogen doesn't produce, it would, the, the explosions are caused by the meltdown itself. This is number three detonation. And what was left was this, just a stump of the original building. And they built this contraption and claimed that everything stayed in the building. Now officially only 2.2 grams got out. The actual plumes covered the plant in this model on 20 days. And it's appropriate that we think that way because that's actually what really happened, right? Dana Drumford will see you in the next one.